If I could have everybody's attention in the press box, please. On behalf of Arizona State University, we'd like to honor Tim Tessalone tonight, who's making his final trip to Sun Devil Stadium after serving USC for over 40 years and doing it with dignity and class and honor and loyalty and all of those things. So on Salute to Service Day and Pat Tillman's birthday, we'd like to give you this jersey. That's awesome. PT42 for all your service. Thank you. Hi, I'm Tim Tessalone. I'm the Sports Information Director at USC. I grew up in Torrance and Redondo Beach and went to USC as an undergrad. I ended up going into PR agency world for two years, decided that's not where my heart was. And so in 1979, I came back to USC. I can still vividly remember when I accepted the job. I was in my little apartment in Hermosa Beach at the time with my uh, girlfriend, who is now my wife, and uh, some friends, and said, I'm taking a 50% pay cut to go back to USC because I really want to work in the world of sports, but I'm only going to do it for two years, and then I'm going to move on. And uh, those two years uh, just have finished here, you know, uh, 43 years later. I get asked a lot, what's my favorite moment at USC or memory? And I always go back to this one that happened early in my career. In 1979, we had a backup tailback on our football team named Michael Hayes. And Michael Hayes hardly ever got on the field because the starting tailback in 1979 was Charles White. He's gone. An incredible display by White. So Michael's not going to get much playing time. And I still can remember exactly where I was in the stadium when the moment happened. We were playing UCLA. It was a kind of a blowout game. Trojans were, were way ahead. And they hand the ball to Michael. He goes 50-some yards for a touchdown, does a somersault or whatever in the end zone. And to me, that moment didn't mean anything in the game. It was really a, a kind of a nothing moment, but that was Michael Hayes' moment. And every kid gets their moment. We work with all sorts of student athletes, superstars, third stringers, right? But they all deserve a moment, they all get a moment, and we should all celebrate those moments. We wanted to, before the night is over, send our best and give our great thanks to Tim Tessel on the longtime football SID here at USC, honored at the Coliseum tonight with his family on the field. Hi, Tim. It's your favorite and best intern of all time here saying congratulations for your career at USC. I know you give me a lot of credit for what you achieved, and I appreciate it because without me, you'd be nothing. Thank you for always being there for me. Thank you for being a friend. You are an absolute legend, and you're the best there is in the business. Well done, well done. The biggest fight ons to you, Tim. Yeah, you know, since I announced uh, that I was retiring, it, it, I've, it's been overwhelming the number of people that have contacted me. There's been so many former athletes reaching out in a lot of different sports. Even some of my former interns, like good old Will Ferrell and people like that. But I guess of all the things I've done made me uh, happy or proud is to have heard from so many former student interns who kind of came back and said, you know, you gave me my start. And that's why we do this, right? It's, it's to give people opportunities and, and have them better. We're at, a, we're at a college, we're at an educational institution. Everything that we do is to help kids Grow. One of the true all-time greats in his profession. Yeah, he really has been the gold standard when it comes to sports information directors. Could not be more thorough, more cooperative, uh, always looking after his players, the media, the coaches, doing a great job with it, and he's been fantastic. The reason I stayed at USC for so long, 43 years, you know, ultimately it's the people. A great group of people here at USC, not only staff, but particularly the student athletes been really blessed to have worked around some incredible student athletes who have performed and excelled at the highest levels possible. I think being around young people on a college campus, really it keeps you young, not only in spirit and heart, but physically it keeps you young. You know, I, I've been really fortunate to be able to do that for my entire career. It's time for somebody else to get to have the fun of, of the job.